welcome back to my channel. This is Lindy, AKA Paleo Barbie. This is gonna be a grocery haul. Let's get started. Guys, I'm back from Aldi, so let's look at what I got. Um, this is a little bit smaller hauls, about 160 bucks um, than I've been getting because I got a few less things because one, we're gonna be out of town the whole week of Thanksgiving and also I'm eating carnivore. So um, I didn't need as much produce just for him. Um, so two packs of the ground pork, the never any, a package of tilapia. I got some more of that Argentine red shrimp because it was just really, really delicious. These were a really good price. So I got two of these top round steaks. I thought that these would be good for me doing carnivore. One pack of bacon because I still have a couple. Um, ahi tuna steaks. So I got this ground beef because they were out of the grass fed ground beef. Um, I just can't believe I'm paying $7 for beef that's not even grass fed. But anyway, that's what I got. <laughs> Chicken nuggets for the grandkids. Some shredded cheese just for convenience because it's a busy time of year. So I got some sharp cheddar. I got some more of the Swiss Gruyere because this is delicious. Got my husband some of the cubes. He likes these for snacking. Then I got three kinds of sliced cheese. Got some smoked salmon. This was on sale for like $4.29 instead of, it wasn't a, a huge savings, but it was like 50 cents off or something. Some plain egg life wraps. I got, um, they had three of these goat cheese dips. They had some flavored ones and they, the flavored ones were 50 calories. These, this was only 45. This is more of the plain, but they had like a garlic and herb and I can't remember what the other one is, but the macros are pretty good. For two tablespoons, it's one carb and, and 45 calories. The other ones were 50 carbs, but I mean 50 carbs, 50 calories, but they still only had one carb as well. So I don't know. I was thinking this would be good on something. Um, I picked up some more eggs. I've got my, my farm eggs tomorrow, but I wanted to get some between now and then. Um, some egg whites. Picked up some half and half for coffee. Some butter, because, you know, can't leave without butter always. Picked up a couple of these pans, because this is the time of year I like to use these, because if I go over to someone's house, I don't have to worry about bringing uh, or washing a pan, I, or if I don't want to bring the stuff home, I can leave it over there. I picked up these moisturizers. I've been getting um, the ones from Walmart, the Equate brand, but it's been hard to get. And they were a really good moisturizer, the collagen one, um, and can't ever get them anymore. So um, these are about the same price. And I got one for me and one for my mom, and then I got a night cream as well. Let me know in the comments if you guys have tried these. Um, and I'm gonna give them a whirl just to see because it's all about saving money right now because everything is cray. Um, they had some new things. They had, um, they've had these keto elevation bars, but these are new flavors for, I guess, the holidays. The chocolate churro and then this um, iced gingerbread. So I picked these up for my husband um, and these are his go-to. So I got him one of these. They also had, you guys, I'll insert a picture at the end, um, some keto stuffing. Now, just like most keto things um, and the keto breads that you find at Aldi and other places, it's got wheat in it and gluten, so I can't have it. But if you can have that stuff and you don't mind a little dirty keto, um, it was it would look just like a box of stuffing, like stovetop or whatever. Um, so I'll insert a picture at the end, but this is the first time I've ever seen it. It was on the Aldi Find aisle. Also got some sunflower seed kernels, some pe pepitas as well. Got the kiddos, some mac and cheese, two new coffees, the mocha mint, and the pumpkin spice. Picked up both of those. Got the grandkids carrots. Everything bagels kit um, for the hubs. I'm not gonna be eating it right now, but he can. he's gonna eat it. Got a vegetable medley for them. I got this one is a new one that I saw over in the, you know, the all defined part of the freezer. Um, I thought that they would enjoy that. And then got them the mixed vegetables. And then some blueberries for the hubs yogurt. So. That is the Aldi um, haul. Not big this time, but that's all we need for right now. So I stopped at a local health food store because I had to pick up something and um, I needed some uh, cottage cheese and I didn't really want to go to Cheese Sprouts just for good culture cottage cheese. So I'm gonna give this brand a try. I never tried it before, but figured as long as I'm not having to run one to one more store, this will do for now, especially since we're going out of town. But um, but yeah, this is the one I'm going to try and now let's go to Sam's. All right guys, this is what we got at Sam's. We got some Quest chips, 
some three three different kinds of or three packs of LaCroix, not three different kinds. I think these two are the same and this one is different. We got some pulled pork again, pulled chicken. He got himself some mixed nuts for snacks. They have the cutest sweatshirts for, for uh, Christmas, you guys. And it's really soft, so I always want one of those. We got the extreme wellness wraps, some uncured ham. We got some pretty flowers. Look at those, y'all. And then some rotisserie chicken. So this is our Sam's haul, about $111, I think. All right, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this grocery haul. Uh, please like, subscribe, do all the YouTube-y things. I will see you guys in the next video.